Hey guys, we are in the basement and uh, I want to show you something that's new down here. It's called Black Widow. I hope you can see that there. And uh, Black Widow, oddly enough, is a mod or a conversion for a Gravatar. So I had a Gravatar cabinet. Um, I like Gravatar. It is a good game. But, you know, back in the day, a lot of people maybe didn't like it so much. So uh, the game wasn't doing well in the arcade, so Atari had this great idea to make a conversion for Gravatar to turn it into a new game and this new game is Black Widow. So I got the conversion kit and it's a pretty easy install. Basically what you do is you, it's a it's a PCB swap or you can actually modify a Gravatar PCB which we have right here. Um, I didn't do that, I actually got a, a Black Widow PCB so I just pulled out my Gravatar one and uh, it's a very easy swap, there's just two edge connectors and it slides out and then you slide the new one in and uh, there's a control panel swap so I had to remove my Gravatar control panel and now I have a Black Widow control panel. Um, Gravatar of course had just buttons. Black Widow has two eight-way joysticks. Um, also, there is a marquee swap, obviously, so I yanked out the Gravatar marquee and put that in there. And other than that, and then I also had to do some rewiring because there just wasn't enough wires on the harness uh, on Gravatar to easily convert it to this, so you have to add four wires uh, to the edge connector. The connector that actually connects here on the PCB there's four unused uh, wire holes, I guess what you want to call them, on the edge connector. And you just hook those in there, and then you run the wires to the, uh, the fire joystick. And so what is Black Widow, you say? Uh, Black Widow is kind of like Robotron. It's, uh, it's a vector Robotron type game with bugs. And uh, so why don't I set up the tripod, and I'll kind of show you how it works. Okay, we are back. The lights are off. We have the tripod set up here, so let's set this up, and I will attempt to play this. Um, I think that'll work just fine. So I'm going to start the game, and the first thing it asks you is, what level do you want to start on? And you can actually choose uh, all the way up to level 21 is the default uh, dip switch setting. So we're just going to start on level 1, uh, which is the very basic level, and... So you are this little bug, and you move with the left stick, and you fire with the right stick. And when you kill the bugs, they drop dollar signs. Why? I don't know, but they do. And so you want to kill them, and then pick up the money. And then, see this bug right here? You actually, that bug will not actually kill you, but he's trying to steal your food. And uh, it's just a competing bug that shows up. So basically, this is the game. It's, it's, it's a lot like Robotron, the way it controls, or Geometry Wars, or one of those other kind of games. And uh, it gets harder and harder as you go along. There's bonus levels. Now, what happened right here is, see this thing right here? That's an egg that got dropped. So I need to push that off the level before it hatches. And here comes another egg, and I actually killed it right, before, right as the bug hatched. And then occasionally, which I haven't figured out yet, these red web lines show up, and I can't, can't pass through that. And that becomes actually part of the level design later in the game, where you can only go certain ways through the level, which is kind of clever. The green ones, I, I, I'm not sure what the green ones mean, to be honest. And then this is like a little bonus level, almost like a Galaga kind of uh, bonus level, and I didn't get all of them, so... Um, so that's basically the game, really, and it gets harder and harder. Um, it's pretty cool. It is... It's probably, I don't, I'm not going to say it's more fun than Gravatar, but I think it has a, a broader appeal than Gravatar, so I'm probably going to be leaving this in my cabinet for a while, but I, uh, I'm i going to miss Gravatar because I really enjoy playing that game. And let me push that egg in there. And then there's all kinds of different bad guys. Some of them explode. And I, don't, I don't know what the hell that thing is, though. I can't seem to kill it. I guess that's a hatch bug. So anyway, there you have it. That is the Black Widow, and uh, it's pretty cool. It's you know, it's it's not a game that you see everywhere, and uh, I, actually, I never played it <laughs> until tonight after I hooked it up, and it, it's pretty cool. So anyway, there you guys have it. Hey, let me show you this real quick too. Um, RC Pro Am 
you guys ever play RC Pro-Am? It's a pretty badass uh, NES game. And I got it for the uh, Play Choice 10. And it's, it's like a little driving game with these like these remote control cars. <laughs> and it's freaking great. I suck at it. Another game I uh, picked up too that's pretty badass on the uh, Play Choice 10 is uh, this is a stupid game. Oddly enough, Chippendale Rescue Rangers is fucking awesome. Whoops. Hang on, let me start it. It's a little platformer, and you can play two players uh, same time. And it's just a great little Capcom platformer from the 80s. And don't let the uh, license fool you. This is uh, a very challenging game, actually. So anyway, there you guys have it in the arcade. See you later. <laughs>